What's up everyone, this is Cybernight8610 and today we're going to open up two of the brand new Yu-Gi-Oh! Cyberstorm Access boxes for you guys. So yeah, I went to the premiere event that went on uh, last weekend. This set should be out uh, later on this week where you'll be able to find it at all retailers, basically your card shops and Walmart and all those kind of places. But uh, yeah, I've just now been able to make a video on these and I'm hoping we're going to get something really awesome. So Let's just jump to it, all right? So, like, subscribe, and all that. I would appreciate it. And also, it's looking like I'll be able to go to the uh, Dallas Collecticon. I think it's actually in Fort Worth, technically, but they keep calling it Dallas Collecticon. And uh, that is this upcoming weekend. So, if any of you guys plan on being there, come by and say hi to me. I'm not going to have a booth or anything, but... Yeah, I'm just going to be around there too. I thought I might see if I can make a video there or, you know, pick up a bunch of cards to open. We'll, we'll see, you know. <laughs> we'll do something, I'm sure. So, I hope to see you guys there and let's get to opening. Let's get a starlight, right? There are pearlies. I'm still so happy those are common. And we got uh, Votus. I don't remember that one. Oh, that's cool looking though. Okay. I don't remember seeing that one. I hadn't pulled that one yet. And then one of the Mechanicos, you know, like the Mechanico stuff, Pearly and Rescue Ace are all uh, common. So, not bad. Gold Pride as well. We got a lot of Gold Pride stuff in this set. Uh, let's see. Aldaria, the June Moon of the June Moon. Another Super. Hope to get that new synchro from this one. There's like a chaos synchro that's a secret rare. Maybe we'll pull that one. We have a kitty tail, uh, mystical beast of the forest. Adorable. I love cats. There we go. That was a little tougher to open. Maybe there's something there. Hopefully. And. Oh, I thought I had it. <laughs> Medanium, though. That is good. That's a good one, too. I was just hoping maybe I called getting that Chaos Synchro. Uh, yeah, Medanium Prime Heart. So, this card looks really cool, too. It kind of reminds me of, uh, it looks like a White Power Ranger, really. You know, with, like, some extra armor. So, it looks amazing, and I kind of want to try out the deck. We'll see. I I'm not really sure if I'm building that one yet or what. We'll, we'll see what happens, but it is really cool looking. There's our first ultra rare. Oh, oh, S4 is Night Chaser. Okay. Keep thinking we're about to see that secret rare. There we are. Virtual World Tiger. Oof. <laughs> That's a pretty good one. And uh, Barmet, the Sacred Sheep Shrub. That's weird to say, but there you go. I do like all the super heavy samurai stuff in this set, too. I'm hoping to pull some of that. I might build that deck. We'll see. Depending on how expensive. I think I still have all my old super heavy stuff, so... Just need the new stuff. Oh, there you go! There's the new Firewall. Firewall Dragon Singularity. This card's pretty awesome, actually. I like this one. He is a Link 6, by the way. So, pretty crazy on that. And, uh, yeah, I have heard the new Firewall stuff is pretty fun. So, might have to check that out. I do like that one, though. He's a cool-looking cover card. I kind of wish maybe they gave another upgrade, though, to, to Code Talker. Because I like the Code Talker a little bit more than Firewall out of Playmaker's cards. But, I mean, that's a sick-looking card still. So, and it has really good abilities. So, Let's see. Super Race Samurai Commander. Get all those Super Heavies. I think it's funny how well they're doing, too. That's a deck I never really thought would get more support or honestly do that well. So I'm happy about that. Wannabe. That's a pretty good card too. Good for uh, Labyrinth. So I think it's really only a one of. So not bad either. It was like short printed for Japan too. So I think technically we have the better printing. Doesn't happen often. Oh, then we have, uh, let's see, uh, Ringo Worm... The Dragon Guarding the Hundred Apples. Yeah, I knew that one had a weird name. But yeah, there's another Ultra for us. I've heard good things about this one too. It's a good tuner monster. So, might be fun to try out as well. I like the artwork quite a bit. So, we'll see. 
We'll see what happens with this set. I think this set will impact the meta quite a bit though, especially with the pearly stuff. It's kind of funny, again, they made it common. I'm, I'm still like shocked by that. Protect Code Talker. There's a Code Talker at least. That one's a pretty decent one too. He's like another access code, sort of. Right, the last one. We have Wish Dragon. And we're getting this one from my early box. So by the way, check out the video if you didn't see it. I opened up a box early with Konami. We had some pretty good luck on that one too. I got like some of the branded support and stuff. Definitely got some good cards. And we have a Teller Knight Alteran. Alteran, I think is how you say it. Yeah. Kind of a weird name. I am very tempted to build those too, just because I think I have everything, you know, besides the new cards yet again. So, because I just kept them, because Teller Knights, I mean, that was a fun deck back in the day. Uh, Medanium Obs Obsession. I think that's how you say that. Come on, give me something awesome. I want to see a Starlight so badly. I don't think we got a Starlight from the previous set. Oh, here's a ultra for us. Um, Gold Pride Chariot Carry. This is one of the ones you can get as a Starlight, actually. Uh, yeah, the new Gold Pride stuff does seem pretty fun. I do want to try it out for myself. We'll see what happens, because I, I think I got everything <laughs> from them. I get it, the previous set, because I feel like I pulled all the Gold Pride stuff pretty easy, as a lot of people did. They were pretty cheap then. I don't think so now. They, they're starting to get a little hype, but not, I guess, too crazy. They want the Dreamings. Thankfully, it's not like they, you know, like tripled or anything, I don't think. Okay, Sulfacord. And sign it Rollback. There's more Mechanco. Next set, too, we get more Pearly and Mechanco and Rescue Ace, so it's kind of funny. I think uh, Amazing Defender is going to be worth picking up, just saying. And Albion, another Albion, the uh, Sanctifier Dragon. Yeah, that's the second one, the Konami box, I got one as well. So this card is awesome. I really love the way this one looks. Again, he looks like a really cool blue eyes or something to me is what it really reminds me of. So yeah, we got two dragons, basically. Can't go wrong with that. First box giving us two dragons. I'll take the double dragons. More super heavies. Uh, Medanium Meek. And I think we're only missing an Ultra, unless we possibly have another Secret or Starlight or something. Hey, you know. <laughs> I, I wouldn't say no to that. Harvest Angel of Doom. That card's actually pretty decent, too, because you can search for the, the Horn of Heaven, basically, and the Black Horn of Heaven as well. I kind of wonder if it will be useful eventually. Oh, here we go. Another uh, Gold Pride. Gold Pride, uh, that came out of nowhere. That's our other Ultra Rare. I like that new Fusion, too. That's, like, in the background. He's, like, standing on a ball or whatever. Katamari is what it kind of reminds me of, you know? He looks awesome. I think he's a Secret Rare, if I remember correctly. Okay. We have the Beastil Albert. Good super. Only like two packs left. Come on, give me that third secret. The mythical third secret rare. Or Starlight. <laughs> it happens. Constellar Teller Knights. And then, last one. What are we ending with? Or at least ending this box with, I should say. It's in a circuit. And S-Force Night Chaser. Unfortunate. Oh, well. We still have another box. So, <laughs> I think we did pretty good, though, with that one. I mean, for real, the secrets were definitely good. I wanted the new Firewall. It does make me want to upgrade my Cyverse. So many things I want to build these days. <laughs> Not enough time. All right, let's get to this one. This is the one that has our Starlight, right? I hope. Then, Tri Brigade Roar. Yeah, I think Singularity is one of the Starlights, so that would be a cool one. You know, the new Firewall as a Starlight, uh, I would take that. 
That one looks pretty sick. I'm still a little annoyed though, Galaxy Eyes didn't get that treatment. Uh, let's see, Time Tearing uh, Morganite. Morganite, I guess? I don't know how you technically say it. You can see it. <laughs> you can see the card. I'll let you decide. And uh, we get Grand Sulfur Cord Coolia. Kind of cool, they got a couple of cards. Same with Bear Tick. All right, super heavy. And Medanium Prime Heart again. So we actually got a double. I might have a place it now of these, I think. So yeah, sure, I'll take it. Again, he is like one of the coolest looking. Give me like some sleeves or something with him on it. I'd take them. Sounds pretty good to me. Our well, Phantom. Constellar Teller Knights. Another one of that. There we are. Pendulum Pendant. And we got Super Heavy uh, Samurai Pro uh, Progeny. That one is, uh, I think, one of the main ones you want. So. What? I think we pulled the Starlight version on one of my streams recently, like the last stream. So. Pretty dang good. <laughs> For Japan, of course. Not our, you know, we didn't get it as a Starlight. Ooh, that, that's the one I was talking about. Gold Pride Rollerballer. I guess that's him by himself. The Fusion, I think, is also a secret rare. But yeah, I actually really like this dude. He's, I don't know if it's going to be, like, enough to really make Gold Pride, like, I don't think they're going to do anything too crazy. But it's pretty cool, too. I do like the new support. And I'm hoping maybe the next set will push them over a little bit more. Because they got better. We just need a little bit more, you know? <laughs> just, just a little bit more of a push. It's a shame that they have you have to get so much good support to be considered good at all now. I feel like it has to be broken support to be considered good. Alright, then Harvest Angel of Doom. I do like the, the playmats and all the stuff they're coming out with Old Pride, and I still say if they're doing all that stuff. They had to make the archetype good, otherwise the stuff won't sell. We have Teller Knight uh, Lyran. I think we're missing an Ultra on this side. Okay. What do we got? And the, well, there's the. Okay, he, he is an Ultra. Okay, I've got to sworn that was the Seeker Rare. Huh, alright. Whatever. Uh, yeah, this Gold Pride Pinballer. So, yeah, he's the one that. Uh, that dude rides on top of like this ball basically so uh yeah i actually really like this fusion it's pretty scary actually and 3000 attack and stuff too i think it's going to do a fair good uh, amount of damage the only thing is again i thought he was secret for some reason maybe i got the two confused either way really good i think so again i'm not saying this is going to destroy cash tira number one no nah, it's not like that but it is a big improvement for the deck for sure so but we're still not there. <laughs> can't can't emphasize that enough. Be still Alber. Also, let me know too, how do you guys do at your uh, premiere or sneak preview? Some people are still saying sneak preview. Hopefully you guys had some good luck. And Votus, how do you say that? I hope you guys got whatever you're looking for already. And, by, and also on that, let me know what you are looking for from this set. Because, again, for me, it kind of ended up being all the stuff that was common is the stuff I wanted. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. <laughs> it's kind of funny how that works. Uh, June Moon, again. Because I mainly wanted the new Spirit Monster, which, there you go, he's coming right there. And then uh, Pearlies, which are both common, too. So I'm like, well, I'm set. <laughs> and a lot of Super Heavy seem to be commons, too. Uh, we have another one of Kitty Tail. It actually worked out for me pretty good, because I really figured the pearly stuff would be at least ultra rare. Firewall Phantom. And S-Force Night Chaser, another one of that. Come on, heart of the cards, give me something good. I'll either take a really good secret rare, or again, I want a Starlight so bad. Let's see, it's been a while since we pulled a Starlight. Gold Pride uh, Chariot Carry. Okay. I don't mind really getting another one of those either because I do want to build Gold Pride eventually. 
I've been kind of slowly collecting them. So I don't know if it'll be this set or maybe even next set. I, I will probably end up building them. Because I feel like they're probably going to get at least one more set worth of stuff. I think normally it goes three or four sets. So we'll see what happens. But just like last set, I just kept picking them up. I'm like, okay, well, maybe I'll do something with these. We got Reincarnation of Seven Emperors. We'll just see what happens, basically. Sleepy memory. And uh, there's the Sacred Sheep again. That one's so funny to me. I don't know that name. All right, heart of the cards. Give me that starlight. Let's see if we can do it. And, ah, oh, there's the other secret. It is gold pride, better luck next time, which, huh, I feel like, I feel like that's just fitting, right? <laughs> this is, I think, probably the best of the new support though for gold pride. This card, I think, is their strongest one. Uh, it's pretty good. It helps you get like more stuff out there, I believe, and stuff too. So, yeah. Uh, it does look interesting, and again, I think there's a little bit of hype with these, but nothing too insane either. I really do feel like they're going to get even better stuff next set. Because again, I feel like Konami really likes to push it. If they're going to make all these accessories for Gold Pride, you got to make people want them, you know? So, we'll see what happens. And we got another uh, Commander. Still possible, though, to get a Starlight or something. I've... The last time I got a Starlight, I think on camera, I got two Secret Rares on the box, so... We'll see what happens. And wannabe. And I, well, are we missing ultra? I think we might be missing ultra. Not exactly sure. We'll see. We'll both be surprised. This guy looks like a mech knight. Every time I see him, I always think he's a mech knight. There's the other ultra rare. We have Ice Jade uh, ran. Ag Adrian? Agrin? I don't know how you technically pronounce that, but there you go. New Ice Jade. So, <laughs> that's all that matters, end of the day. And only two packs left. Can okay, give me that legendary third secret rare? Then, Protect Code Talker. And now, last pack. What are we ending with? Let's see. And with a secret rare, right? Or Starlight. I mean, aim big. So Accord Symphony. And, ah, Wish Dragon. So, yeah. I feel like my boxes were pretty good. The first one I liked a little bit more. But then again, I don't mind getting a few Gold Pride things either. So, I feel like, you know, the second one was definitely a Gold Pride box. For sure. And, like I keep saying, I think they will be good eventually. But that first box, definitely good. Albion and Firewall Singularity is definitely good to pick up. And yeah, I'm kind of happy I keep getting Medanium stuff too. I'm kind of tempted to build them. So we'll see what happens. But let me know what you guys think about this set. For me, I think I'm still more excited about the next one. Like Duelist Nexus, that one just looks like a lot of fun. And uh, it gives me a lot of 5D support. So I feel like I'm going to be more excited when we get to that one, honestly. But this is still a good set. It's definitely not a bad one. Um, but it just kind of depends what you're looking for. But like I said, it just so happened to work out that the main cards I wanted really from the set were commons. So I guess it did good for me on that then. But yeah, as always, thank you guys for watching, liking, subscribing, all that. I really appreciate it. And of course I will catch you guys later. See ya.